Well, I'm here to talk about genetic risk assessment and individualized treatment for breast cancer. But what I'm going to be talking about is applicable to different types of cancers. Well, you know, I'm a medical oncologist and I treat women with breast cancer mostly. Um, and I watch women die from preventable breast cancers. And uh, once I figured out that there are some women who are predisposed to getting breast and ovarian cancer, then more than 20 years ago, I started a cancer risk clinic. And my goal was not just to identify these women as being high risk. I really was determined to find the best way to help them manage their risk over their lifetime. We know we're all going to die of something, but it's really important for us to convert cancer into a chronic condition that you manage. And so when BRCA1 and BRCA2 were identified as really powerful predictors of breast and ovarian cancer, then I really wanted to do everything I can do to learn how to prevent cancer in those women.